I'm Paul Hollywood, and I'm sort of a baker and part-time racing driver. I love getting in cars, I love racing. When I did that for the first time, honestly, I've never been so excited in my life. I've been into cars for as long as I can remember. When I was a little boy, that was my favourite car. DB5, James Bond car, that started my passion in cars. The more than just transport from A to B, they're a thing of enjoyment, they're a thing for me that I use to de-stress. <laughs> what really fascinates me is what cars say about their owners and about the people who made them. Come on, go for an Italian way, give it well -y. In fact, I reckon you can learn a lot about a country by looking at the cars it produces. <laughs> what? <laughs> and by driving on its roads. We're driving this beautiful car and we have the Italian Alps in front of us. So, I'm off on a European road trip, visiting some of our most car-obsessed neighbours. Checking out the history, the culture, the people, and what makes the country very special when it comes to cars. This time, I'm visiting our nearest neighbours. So, we're going on a six-day road trip round central France. Just over 1,000 miles in some of the nation's most iconic, cleverest and cutest cars. Oh, my God! <laughs> Slow down! Day one, we're starting in Paris. From Paris, we head a little bit northwest to Poissy. From Poissy, southwest, down to Chat. This. <laughs> From Chat, we head southwest again to Le Mans. And then from Le Mans, we head south all the way down to clermont ferrand Then on my final day, I'll be racing at Manicourt. What a view. It's going to be a giggle. Along the way, I want to learn a little bit more about this country through its cars. What is that? Are the French eccentric? Why? Do they actually like cars? Honestly, I don't care. Really? Yeah. And do they even have a highway code? It's crazy. How I know. Does this work? Don't be polite. Joining me will be some slim people. They'll teach me about France's relationship with cars. Having a flashy car would be a, a, an accoutrement of the bourgeoisie. While their cars teach me, oh. I could lose a few pounds. <laughs> this could be a slight issue with aerodynamics. This being France, there'll also be a fair amount of shrugging. The chef repeatedly saying, ooh la la, ooh la la, ooh la la. And some very fresh ingredients. Oh, this is a nightmare. Six days and a thousand miles for me to learn how to drive like the French. 